Hi, I'm Arthi Kumar Jain, the founding director of Love and Light for Kids. Love and Life for Kids is a program that helps with coaching for parent, child, and family. I want to thank you for this opportunity to talk to you about how parenting has been impacted by COVID and how we're entering a new era of parenting in general. Some tips to share that um, you could easily do for yourself and for your kids. A lot of difficulties have been faced with technology and, and the role that it plays. And one of the things I can encourage you as a parent is just to remember the delicate balance that does exist and to be patient with yourself. Here is a pretest to see if you can read and understand this story. I know in my own house we have had an exorbitant amount of screen time and it can be difficult even after the school day is done to find the balance of turning it off. And that screen fatigue for the kids, so you can be like stop and drop whatever you're doing and taking mindful moment breaks. Always those reminders of breathing. Click the right answer. I have had um, children who literally have found even doing something of a small practice, such as squeezing a ball or Play-Doh, completely that pathway from the brain to their hand, that kinesthetic movement, that they literally can have a shift in their behavior. If you're still having a child who has a hard time with the virtual school as we um, are still in it for a little bit longer, fingers crossed, um, is that to help them to focus is doing a quick chair yoga pose. Like they can literally have their hands underneath their chair and just putting their hands down if they want to have a shift. They can even bring their hands and do a quick little grip. They can even do what's called cross lateral bilateral fix and just take their hands and just put them in. Nobody's gonna see them, right? And also building some deer time. Drop everything and read. It's a time that everyone can pick up something to read 15 or 20 minutes on a weekend. And the kids also love this time where you can also read something that you find a pleasure to them. Don't talk about school. I never want to say anything. This past year has been a learning curve for you, for me, and for also the world. And to just show yourself appreciation and gratitude is the message that I like to send you. Thank you.